Uh, the family, uh, we're only hearing them through their attorney, but I want to get to that statement, uh, uh, which read in part, Fred, it says, our client Eric Munoz has authorized us to give notice that today at approximately 11.30 a.m. Central Time, 12.30 p.m. Uh, Eastern Standard Time, Marlise Munoz's body was disconnected from life support and released to Mr. Munoz. The Munoz and Machado families, that's the parents of Marlise Munoz, uh, will now proceed with the somber task of laying Marlise Munoz's body to rest and grieving over the great loss that has been suffered. They continued by saying, may Marlise Munoz finally rest in peace and her family find the strength to complete what has been an unbearably long and arduous journey. That journey lasting about eight and a half weeks. Uh, Marlies Munoz was legally pronounced brain dead on November 28th. Now, about an hour before we got this statement from the family's attorney, uh, we got a statement from the hospital. And I want to read uh, that in part that read from the onset. JPS has said its role was not to make nor contest law, but to follow it. On Friday, a state district judge ordered the removal of life-sustaining treatment from Marlies Munoz. The hospital will follow the court order. Now, Frederica, all along, JPS Hospital has maintained that they were simply following state law and that they did nothing wrong because they had no legal precedent to go off of. Now, I reached out to the vice president of communications for the hospital asking uh, if they still plan on appealing the judge's order because they still, despite removing uh, Marlies Munoz from the ventilator, have the opportunity to appeal. Uh, they told me, Nick, we're going to follow the court's mandate. Mm. Fred? And, and so now what is next? Now it's uh, moving on to the grieving process for the Munoz family, uh, finding a, a funeral home uh, to continue on with the burial for Marlise Munoz. We did reach out to the attorney beyond this statement uh, to try to get comment to see if Eric Munoz will be making any on-camera statements to talk about uh, you know, this, this, this anguishing time for the family and, and really all involved uh, in this entire situation. Uh, we have not heard back from the attorney or from the Munoz family. Fred? All right. Nick Valencia, thank you so much from Fort Worth. Keep us posted.